supposed to be a moment What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? One man, one show! One you army, nigga! <laughs> I'm a go! God, nigga! What? Really, nigga? What's good, little niggas? How y'all motherfuckers feeling, man? Look, bro. So I'm about to give y'all the best video for stretch bigs, centers, and pure sharps, and shooters in general. Easily the best on YouTube. So be sure to watch the full video. I'm a somewhat go in depth with a lot of builds and why you should do this and that, you know, um, wingspan recommendation, height, all that shit, nigga. So be sure to subscribe if you know, man. I'ma always help y'all with a lot of shit. I'm gonna be the best in the game. If you guys didn't know, I am making a stretch this year. I'ma show y'all my build and why I'm making it. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a fucking god. A lot of people think stretches are gonna be dead, but bro, these niggas ain't been passing like four years. You feel me? Maybe like a certain way, but but you'll see. Look, and also guys, last night we made history, bro. Mike Wayne came into my stream and I basically, I saved 2K19, my guy. I basically had the greatest conversation with him than he's ever had with any other influencer, ever. I swear to God, you know? Um, I'm gonna drop a video on that later, so y'all look out for that. Make sure if you watch that, you know, blah, blah, blah. Make sure y'all like my shit, nigga. Share this shit with your friends if they have ideas on making pure sharps and stretch bigs and all that shit. Now look, first of all, off rip, I'm pretty sure y'all already know this. Y'all have been begging. Make sure y'all turn on post notifications. And if you are sensitive to strong language, get the fuck out my off my video, bitch, okay? Get your lame ass out of here, fuck nigga. We don't fuck with your kind, bro. You feel me? Like, <laughs> I'm about to say all types of shit. Uh, but look, bro, so, I'm gonna show y'all this center shit. For the niggas who don't know, you know, um, power forwards have way better badges than centers. I don't know if you're out the loop. A lot of y'all probably not on Twitter and shit like that or YouTube like that. But look, so off rip, you know, like his ratings are going to be the same as the power forward. But look at this. So you get two Hall of Fame badges, only pick and popper. The rest is gold. Your limitless is on silver, you know, so. But when you go to power forward, it's the stretch of old. So that automatically cuts this down for the stretch big shit. You feel me? Well, it doesn't cut it down. Well, I mean, basically. And you can already see his stats like weak. You feel me? I'm going to show y'all the safest stretch big build that would be that it, it's automatically going to be nice in 2K19. Like, probably like the best. It could be possibly the best overall center, bro. Just for the fact that you could still do probably stretch big shit and like still rebound and shit you know and um but look so i'm gonna show y'all some shit right so if you go to the pure stretch right matter of fact let me just show y'all my build right now J just so you know the shit real my iq is high this will be the build i am a hundred percent making in nba 2k19 a hundred percent okay a hundred percent Okay, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna go over all the stretch big builds and even the pure sharp shit. Now look, so his mid range is still gonna be high as shit. His fucking his three points still gonna be high as shit. Now look, okay, oh like you know that's 23, whatever. But then when you look at this, like no 21. A lot of people might make this type of shit. But look, this is more overall all around. You know my shit, my my shot still gonna be high as shit. This shit helps my fucking... I'm going to show you the badges soon. This shit helps my steals, my strength. So just in case I can't, like, my vertical... Well, even having a lockdown in secondary, it helps my vertical, my lateral quickness, my speed, my acceleration, my strength, my stamina. So I could box out these big-ass niggas that are probably going to make, like, big-ass 7-3 guys. I could box them out because I'm going to be strong as shit, you know? And then... For this build, I'm making max wingspan. Max wingspan. 
even though that makes my my shot like a 76 but look at this look look at this okay i'm still gonna have all my shooting badges on gold on gold okay all of them all the best ones on gold you feel me corner specialist deep range dead eye limitless range pick and popper tireless score catch and shoot and then i'm gonna have like you know mid-range dead eye difficult shots now look at this defensive stopper on silver they're they're constantly promoting that all these builds or all these inside builds are just gonna dog niggas they've shown animations when niggas go and take over they're just throwing niggas on the ground they're saying all this post spin shit so having a defensive center build is very wise you know they can't dick you in the paint if you taking their badges down you feel me this shit on silver brick wall silver chase down artist silver then i'm gonna have max wingspan bro my steel probably gonna be high as shit nigga you know posterizer you know rim protector bronze you know so basically i'm still going to get a high ass stretch big three you feel me i mean even if, if i had a default my three would probably be like in the in the 80s like high 80s you know but it's gonna start off as a probably like a 76 and then it's gonna go to 80 something once i get upgrades and shit you know so that's good that's good enough for me i'm still be able to dick niggas what y'all gotta understand is with every shot i'm shooting over 100 my 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 rating okay and i'm most likely gonna be open so that gives me a shooting boost you feel me and you know i think this is the only weakness to this nigga he's is his rebound that's it you know but making a pure stretch is extremely risky you might be able to dick niggas like of old and shit but you man they that they, they keep saying that these niggas are gonna get murdered but look, look at this you know look at his speed his defense all that shit but now look at this like he's more well-rounded you feel me way more well-rounded and then i'm gonna be able to you like look for instance like if i'm playing twos and shit right when the when the fucking nigga with the ball switches and then he has to guard center and i have to guard ball i'm not getting dicked you know i'm gonna be able to guard that nigga i'm gonna be able to probably get some steals i'm gonna be bumping niggas making shit real bumpy nigga you feel me like it's no longer oh he's a stretch big he has no d oh this stretch big has d you feel me so very strong build this is the build that will be extremely safe okay this is probably it could possibly be the best overall stretch big build or this could but mine's more risky it's it's hard to explain this is more safer okay this is way like not way this is just more safer you know all his down low stats go higher his rebounding goes higher you know and he, he decent nigga you know like he's a rebound and stretch four so look he got all the gold shooting badges hustle rebounder silver brick wall silver bruiser silver defensive stopper bronze so you know like you know th this is a very strong stretch big build okay now with this guy it makes him more all around but still his lower half is weak as shit you know nobody really knows how much they're gonna get murdered on rebounds like they're you know they're they really trying to buff glass cleaners bro so this is he could probably dick niggas you know like look look at his badges pick and popper hall of fame you know he get the mid-range gold he get he get a lot of offensive like godlike shit you feel me but you know his defense his rebounding the you know is, is sus you know like you could get dicked really bad so this build you know they could be hella rewarding but you never know man and also you can make it like this bro well they don't have shot created at the top here's another way here's another stretch big now um this is strictly a highlight reel type of shit if you don't give a fuck 
I was thinking that maybe his high vertical, right? His high vertical, he's going to be faster. He going to all his down low shit, you know, lateral quickness. He's going to be way faster. He's going to be able to finish at the rim better and still shoot threes at a high percent, you know? He got all the shooting badges on gold plus posterizer on silver. But he's risky. You feel me? He's risky. Because what if when you box niggas out, you still can't get the board, you know? Maybe you can because of your high ass vertical. That's what I was thinking. But, you know, defense, all that shit. I don't know. Maybe you can make your, your stretch big like this. If you just want to do like highlight reels for the two, you have a stretch big dick of niggas from three and like dunking on niggas. The posterizer silver, nigga. You know, like, I don't, you, I don't know, man. Maybe. But also, I'm not recommending max wingspan for all that other shit because you guys probably aren't like me, right? I'm really trying to make a statement on, like, defense. So I'll probably be able to get interceptor badges or intercepted passes way easier with the build I'm making with max wingspan. And that shit's going to help my steals, rebounding, and, and all that shit, you know? So I'm, I'm trying to make sure, like, I'm not getting dicked. So I'm gonna be playing twos with this nigga so I can play with a lot more people and play more often. Well, my ISO guy, bro, I'm still making that nigga, guys. He gonna be my main build, but it's harder to find decent niggas to run with. As a center, it's way easy. Then I can just go on twos and dick niggas and not try, you know? Because twos is so easy. It's so easy to be a stretch big. Literally, it is easy. And you could put in mad hours as a center. It's no effort, there's no stress. Even if someone does come and beat you, it's like they're not really beating you. Because you're a center. Who brags about going to be the center? Like, let's be honest. When you go and be the guard, that's when niggas be talking crazy. But a center, niggas, nobody don't give a fuck, you know? <laughs> nobody gives a fuck. So that's exactly why, you know, off rip, off rip, I'm making my guard. And then I'm making my center, too. So it's going to be nice, bro. Now, probably off rip. You can have a um, default wingspan and, you know, probably still hit 80s. I don't have the exact ratings for these hoes. But, yeah, don't make this build. I don't give a fuck what no one says about no high-ass dimer. Man, get, get, get control of your fucking life, my nigga. Post scoring, you know, he got some decent badges and shit, you know. But it's not really, you know, pick and pop or Hall of Fame, you know, blah, blah, blah. But, look, so, look, here's another way how to make your centers. So, say, say you did it like this slashing three point now his rating's not going to be as high on the three point but he's still going to be able to hit corner threes then he's going to be overall uh, a better center overall you feel me so if you want to make safe builds like this but your reward might not be as high as putting three point but safe builds this way you know you can make a little slashing three point nigga or you can make it's all the, it's all up to you bro or you can make this guy this is he dog. Look at look at that bottom half. Look at, look at how high that nigga steals is. Blocks all that shit. Like this nigga's a dog, but his reward might not be as high. He might not be able to dick niggas from three just like all the other two cases. It it's all depends on you how much money. Look, defensive stopper on gold, pick dodger, pick pocket, rim protector. Chase. This nigga is a dog. Okay, dog. Deep range, dead eye, silver, all the shoot. He's a dog, you know. I'm, I'm. See, look. If I wasn't doing YouTube, and I just like wanted to win, and it's not about like flashy type shit, I would make this nigga, you know. If I was just on some competitive type shit, and I would just dick niggas, bro. This is a dog, bro. Like he's going to fucking murder niggas, and it's more safe with your money. Mine's more risky, you know, but and more highlighty, and you know I could show off for the tube and shit. But yeah, and even builds like this, like more safe, but less rewarding, you know. So it's all it's all up to you. This guy, more all all around, more safe, but less rewarding. These niggas are all confirmed post scoring, rebounding, defending, you know, the driving. With the three-point secondary, you're strong, okay? But if you don't have this defense, you might get dicked. Niggas can't dick you in the paint if you got defense. So 
I'm just saying, bro. But it's all up to you. All It's all up to what you want to make, man. Now, with these pure sharps, bro, I don't, I'm not trying to make this video stupid long, bro. Because y'all know I, I be talking, man. There's so much information. I can literally go in super depth and just talk for fucking like two hours about this shit, bro. There's hella variables, my nigga. So, like, I don't know. I'm just trying to recommend shit for what y'all want to do. Now, for this pure sharp shit, right? And even, you don't even gotta, you could you could do some shit like this. Nigga could be a dog more all around. He could dunk. You feel me? And then you could still, like, have a high-ass three. It's all up to you. Look, look at his badges. Dicking niggas. Super OP build. But if you want the pure sharp of old, bam. You know, when you, when you make a small forward, I don't think you have limitless on Hall of Fame. You know? You have it on gold. As a shooting guard, you get better... Hall of Fame badges. This is the nigga of old. So look, a 6'8 pure sharp is better than a 6'10. Do not make a pure sharp small. You don't have to. You could just give your pure sharp T-Rex arms. You understand that, right? You know, when, when you're pure sharps, you're not looking to rebound or none of that shit. Anyways, no one's counting on you to rebound, bro. You know, no one's counting on. So you can have a high ass 83 damn near 90 shooting guard have all these look let me show y'all the small forward version a lot of y'all stupid niggas out here make a pure small pure sharp for what so you can supposedly move faster look nigga when you're bigger you move the same speed it just doesn't look as fast when you're when you're bigger you take up more space okay so you you're basically traveling at the same distance, bro. If you're not boosting, bro, that shit really don't matter, man. You're not speed boosting. See, look, limitless is is gold, bro. You feel me? So it's all up to what you want to do. Six, six ten or six eight. I recommend the the six eight. I think it's overall better. You can also put shot creating first if you want to be more overall. Be able to drive, dunk, have better D, better speed, all that shit. Um, let, let's take a look at the build, bro. Yeah, man, I, I'm trying to stress these points to y'all, bro. Like, there's no reason, if you're not speed boosting, to have a small build, bro. Seriously. Like, come on, bro. And also, this nigga, he can shoot godlike, nigga. Look, look at this shit, you know? So, look, his dunks is high, layups is high, mid-range is high, three-point ball handling. Even think this build can speed boost when you make this nigga small, bro. Like 6'3 or some shit. You're gonna have to look at the chart. Post offense is high. Like, look at the steals. Look, look at all this shit, nigga. Hold on. Like, all lateral quickness. All, all that shit improves, bro. Like, the speed, acceleration, strength, stamina. But then when you go like this, look. Look at the difference. Look at the difference. Huge difference. Big difference. So you can make a sharp shooting shot creator. Look at that. Huge difference. More all around. This is safer. Okay. This is a safe build. If you don't have a lot of VC, you know, I'll recommend this. But if y'all want to be a pure sharp, you know, it's, it's all up to you. But let's look at the nigga badges. Hall of Fame mid-range dead eye. OP. Difficult shots. OP. Difficult shots going to pop, pop up every time you shoot. Tyler score. Always gonna pop up. This probably this nigga probably overall better. I ain't, I ain't gonna hold you. Corner specialist, all the shooting badges still gold. You're not gonna be able to be as highlighty with limitless range on um silver. You got ankle breaker silver, you know, so you could probably do some snatchbacks and shit. But yeah, bro. The only difference is when you enter takeover mode, you're gonna be entering the shot creator shit for ankles. Okay? So that's something to think about until you're 94 and then you activate like both takeovers but with the pure sharp the primary you're going to be able to you know off rip get all those three point shit and then when you go to 94 your shit lasts longer and it's like straight dick session so it's it's all up to you bro but um yeah man that is the motherfucking video bro y'all let me know if this was very helpful let me know if this not the best stretch big video uh, on YouTube, bruh. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. My nigga, I'm an IQ god, nigga. Been looking at this shit forever. 
um make sure y'all subscribe make sure y'all like the video go like and watch all my other videos man i went to depth about a lot of builds a lot of guards a lot of a lot of a lot a lot of shit you feel me um make sure y'all follow me on twitch okay support a nigga link in description my twitch is lord baby hawk um make sure y'all sub to it you know support a young nigga on my, my my little grind bro subscribe to a nigga you'll be able to get added play with a young nigga every now and then my lit ass emotes no fucking ads because i am going to be spamming ads on twitch so you better sub up bitch i don't give a fuck nigga make sure you follow me on twitter that shit is swan tz baby follow me on ig snap all that shit bro um i appreciate all the love and support man i read all my comments i heart all them hoes nigga this shit take a lot of time so y'all better appreciate that shit um let me know what y'all want to see next I hope you niggas have an amazing day. One day left, nigga. <laughs> y'all let me know what first build y'all gonna make. Drink a gallon of water a day. It keep the acne away, bitch. And um.